Hey guys, it's me, Reem. Um, this time with a new uh, video. This one is about, um, about voice project. This is something that I've really noticed uh, happening in my YouTube videos. When the early one where I started, I was very high pitched. Like, hey, hello everyone, this is Reem. Uh, it's like up, you know, like a, like a, ver like a diagonal arrow up. It's the, the voice is projected towards the sky. Um, and I became aware of that. And I was like, wow, sometimes I'm, it's very, it's lower. Sometimes, most of the times it's high. So I should be aware of that and make the adequate uh, changes. And what really helps me uh, on getting that voice projection uh, right is actually visualizing that I shoot it kind of like downwards to the ground, like I throw my from my mouth through my heart into the ground. Uh, it's like really like down or like diagonally down, like towards the feet or something. It may sound very strange for you to apply it that way, but you can try with it. That's something I've noticed by just adding in a little visual element on changing the yeah the the, the voice projection, how you project your voice something that they teach about this as well is if you speak for to a person and you want to speak more loud then just imagine that that person is further away from you so let's say you're talking with someone and you speak very uh, very uh, soft you can imagine that you that the person is 10 meters uh, at a bigger distance from you and something else one last thing I'd like to share about this voice projection is also training the voice muscles. There is an exercise I've learned from Hypnotica many years ago, and it's actually a simple one. You just uh, grab, a, grab a towel and you put it around your hands because otherwise you slide from your tongue. You pull your tongue out and you just say very softly, a very low in a bass tonality voice. You say, like, uh, so you pull your tongue out. I cannot do it now, it's sliding. You pull it out and you just say, ah. So you really use those, those voice tendons uh, muscles to, uh, to strengthen them. And as you all know, the bigger the muscles are, the, the more strong they are, and the lower the vibration gets. So that's something I'd like to share with you as well, guys. It's a little bit about the voice protection. It's also extremely important for interacting with women. I'm originally from the Netherlands, from the south of the Netherlands, uh, Limburg, where people speak in all statements and actually basically every sentence where they end up in the, in the sentence structure in the, in the end. It's like I do that in the end, you know, they, they end up. And for women, it's, it's really different if you end up lower, if you end up, if you bring it down in the end. So that's something else about voice, voice projection and voice strength. Uh, just see for yourself how much of this stuff you need right now. Just see, compare yourself with other men that you find powerful. Do you, if you are in conversation with one or with other ones, um, do you get listened to? Uh, do you get interrupted? Uh, does your messages land? Is there a calmness and a strength in your voice? This is something that you should for sure become aware of. Ask your peer friends and other people uh, for feedback on this. If you think you need some training on this as well. Um, and then just see how much of it you wanna, you wanna train on that. It could be good to implement it in your morning routine. This little exercise with a towel and pulling your tongue, for example, you can do it for one or two minutes every day. It's, uh, that's already very helpful compared to having it not at all done. So, yeah, just see how much you, you think you need it. And ask for that feedback and then just apply it in your life. Uh, this, this voice uh, as a part of your toolkit is extremely, extremely important, guys. This is uh, by far one of the main components for, for seduction at all. There has been some researches, I'll put a link below, and of course these researches can always be discussed, but the point they're trying to say is that 
after body language, which is about 55%, the tonality of your voice is uh, the second biggest importance for your communication. So when you are communicating with a woman, of course, you are communicating, you are seducing her, you are interacting with her, and you, you create and you leave a certain impression. And by having your voice uh, projection and your voice quality in place, the, that saves you a lot of work. And that's actually the 20% of the work who get, that gives you the 80% of the results of your entire, let's say, it's verbal communication. It's just the quality of your of your uh, voice. So that's um, something I'd like to share with you now, guys. Uh, this also, of course, uh, adds to the point that the content of, and the words of, of your voice are not so important. This is a natural consequence of that statement. So. Yeah, hope you find it valuable. Let me know in the comments, like and subscribe. See you in the next one, guys.